All right, so what's the difference between um, the probability of something happening um, um, and the odds of something happening? The odds in favor of something happening or the odds against of something happening? So we've got these two concepts, probability and odds, and they're very related, um, but they're different. So probability is a measure of, um, it's a ratio of the number of favorable outcomes, you know, whatever you're trying to look at, um, versus the number of total possible outcomes. So for example, let's let's um let's look at this number four. We've got an experiment where we're gonna roll a die. Um and so that's our favorable outcome is rolling a four. Okay, so the number of favorable outcomes uh is only one in, for rolling dice. So um number of favorable outcomes would be one. Um, you know, if there's, if you have, well, let me give you an example where there's more than one favorable outcome. Um, maybe, um, if you're pulling, pulling cards out of a deck and you want to calculate the probability of, um, pulling a red card out of the deck, um, there's lots of red cards in the deck. So the number of favorable outcomes w will be high. Um, I actually forget how many red cards there are in a deck of cards. Um, I'm guessing it's just half, so 25, 50, yeah, or 20, 26. How many cards are there? 52, 50. I don't know. Anyway, there's a lot more. There's a lot more red cards than than just one. So if you're calculating the probability of um, pulling a red card out of a de uh, out of a deck of cards, there would be a lot of favorable outcomes, more than one. Okay, but in the case of rolling dice, and you you're calculating the probability of of getting one of the numbers, then you'll have one favorable outcome. Uh, here's what I should have done. How about uh, you could calculate the probability of rolling? Let's do that. All right, back up. Let's calculate the probability of rolling an even number. There we go. So there's um, probability of um, of A, and I'm going to call A rolling an even number. Rolling and, yeah, okay, sorry, uh, an even number. Okay, so how many favorable outcomes are there? There's one, two, three. There's three different even numbers uh, on one of these regular um, six-sided dice. Um, so three. Um, uh, so probability is the number of favorable outcomes over the number of possible outcomes. So how many possible outcomes are there? Well, there's si six different numbers that you could roll when you when you roll a die. So six. So um, the probability of rolling an even number would be three uh, over six, which to make that into a um, decimal would be 0 0.5. You know, a half. Three is half of six, so 0.5. Okay, so that's probability. Now odds is um, odds are a, a a ratio between probabilities. So the odds in favor of something happening um, are the probability that the event will happen versus the probability that the that the event won't happen. So let's let's look at um, rolling the number three. Okay, um, first of all, what's the probability that we'll roll uh, three? Well, the number of favorable outcomes would be one. There's only one three. Uh, the total outcomes are six. There's si six different numbers you could roll. Okay. So um, the odds. So we've got. So odds in favor would be the probability that an event will happen. Um, and if our event that we're looking at is rolling the number three, the probability is w is one out of six. Um, now versus the probability that the that an event won't happen. So what are the odds that you won't won't roll a three? Well, there's um, let's see. I'm gonna switch colors here. Um, there's one, two, three, four, five numbers that aren't threes. So you've got a five out of six probability of of not rolling a three. So the odds in favor of rolling a three would be um, this probability, one out of six over this probability, 5 out of 6. Um, since, alright, so we're dividing two fractions here, so uh, since they have the same denominator, we can we can 
disregard those denominators, they would cancel out. So we can reduce this to um, 1 to 5. Um, so the odds in favor of rolling a 3 are uh, 1 in 5, or you could say uh, 1 to 5. You've got a 1 in 5 chance in, in favor of, of rolling a 3. And now odds against is just the other way around. Um, you, you do. In this case, it would be um, the odds uh, against rolling a 3 are, are 5 to 1. So 5 to 1. You know, the odds of rolling a 3 are 5 to 1 against. So probability is just a comparison between um, number of outcomes. So you've got favorable outcomes versus the total possible outcomes. Um, odds are comparisons of probabilities. Uh, so odds in favor are the probability that an event will happen. Um, odds against, uh, over the probability that an event won't happen. And then odds against are just the reverse of that. The probability that an event won't happen versus the probability that an event will happen.